This is Windows 7 Ultimate RTM on uh, an Acer Aspire 1. This is with uh, the default full arrow. You can disable it for a little bit better speed, but for performance uh, examples, I'll leave it on. That was uh, the amount of time it took to boot up Firefox. Uh, the first time you turn on the computer, it takes a little bit longer, so I'll open it again. Internet Explorer. Not too much time. This is pretty much um, a clean install of uh, Windows 7. I installed a couple programs, just like Firefox, Office. Uh, now I'll show you the amount of time it takes to open Office applications. Excel. Word. And now I'll open them both. As you can see, I can open multiple instances of it, and it doesn't really affect performance too much. Um, I've changed the media player to media player classic it's a little bit better for uh, netbooks um, Just going to open a couple different programs.
and I'll show you the Windows key tab feature. Not very much lag there. <clears throat> Multiple tabs. Switching themes goes pretty smoothly. As you can see, You can choose uh, wallpapers to cycle. As you can see in the background right now, I have different wallpapers cycling. Uh, you can choose the amount of time to have them cycle. You can shuffle. And this doesn't really affect the performance of uh, the Aspire one on Windows 7. Uh, if you need a little bit more speed, you could always disable arrow, but I don't find it too slow while arrow is enabled on mine anyway. Um, you can get a preview of different uh, applications that are open. All in all, pretty smoothly, uh, this is all with uh, a virus protection software installed. Um, right now using Malwarebytes. And uh, that's pretty much it for the performance on the Aspire 1. Uh, again, that's Windows 7 Ultimate. RTM, uh, wireless network connects within the first second of uh, signing in, definitely very fast, and battery life, right now, actually yes, right now um, I have it on balanced for the power setting. Uh, that is because I'm currently plugged in. But if you were to go mobile, you can choose Power Saver. And this, uh, this decreases the performance slightly but barely noticeable. Uh, I'll show you right now. Now on battery power. that's opening Firefox. Uh, previously I had Windows XP on here and I don't notice too much of a performance difference. And here's the shutdown process.